welcome back to my channel my name is Laura and this video may be very long I have 55 I think I collected 55 cheek sparrows to share with you today and I'm gonna share with you each size and I will also mention what I do with each size so this may be very long I will start with the small ones which are nanos and then I will work my way up to the bigger ones um, sorry Daisy wants to go out so I will be back okay I'm gonna start off with the nanos and the nanos is the smallest size that they sell um, the nano is what I use for my wallet so I have quite a bit of them um, and I store them in this box. It's uh, my journey is my inspiration. I got this at Michael's when they had like a 30 or 40% off. And um, it's a really pretty box. It fits really nicely in here. Um, and I'm going to open it up and share a very pretty box. So that's what I store my nanos in. Um, as I said, it is my wallet. So as I carry it in my bag... I carry it in a Cheek Sparrow Misty Mountain um, pouch. This is the small size, um, and I have my Nano in here. So I'm going to share with you the wallet, the wallet first. Uh, and uh, what I am carrying right now is the purple, Mr. Darcy Purple, which I got off the buy, sell, trade list. Purple is my favorite color. Mr. Darcy, I have my um, um, problem with because it does scratch very, very um, bad. Uh, you look at it and it scratches. So I don't know if you can see all those scratches, but this is what I'm using as my wallet today. Um, and in here I have a Foxy Fix wallet insert, which is another purple. Uh, uh, it's the Foxy Fix thing goes around the back. So this is how I carry my wallet. So I am doing cash uh, only and the cash only I have these cash envelopes that I carry around with me to sort out my cash so that's how I am carrying my wallet so okay so when I open up I have other colors to choose from but right now I'm using the purple okay so in here are my other colors and I also have a foxy fix in here um, I will share that as well uh, because it is a, um, a zero size uh, and I needed to have it so I will show you that as well it's in here so here we go I don't I might not know the name of the colors but I do know the name of the leathers so I will let you know that okay so as I open this up here are all my nanos I have a Pemberley uh, this is a castle rock color uh, this I got off the buy sell trade list um, yeah, Pemberley is my favorite color, um, favorite leather. Uh, it has the dots on it, um, and it does not scratch, which is my perfect, um, I don't like scratches, I don't like marks, so, uh, Pemberley is my favorite. So, here I have a Castle Rock, I have, um... This was my favorite during the summertime. This is what I was carrying. It does change colors. This is called a daisy, I believe. And this is Pemberley as well. Uh, it is starting to turn brownish with my hands because I did use this for my summer wallet. Uh, so that got a lot of use. Uh, then I have a Mr. Darcy Titanic. There you go. I got this off the buy sell trade list. This is ex uh, expired. Uh, it's very hard to get the Titanic color, but this is my second favorite color. Uh, I have a red. This one I got. This is a Frasier, uh, Outlander Frasier. Um, and this one I got free. Uh, I should really be using this one now in the month of December, but uh, I forgot I had this. And I got this free when I bought an A5. Um, yeah, so uh, Chick Sparrow had a special sale. And yeah, so it's a nice red color. Great for Christmas time. 
Then I'm uh, back to Pemberley. I have the fern, and I think I got this off the buy sell trade list as well. Uh, this is green fern, and then I got a. This one is a Pemberley as well. I th I don't remember the name is this one. I think it's rose or something like that, but it's a pink color. Um, and yeah, so that's that one. And then in here, I have a Foxy Fix and I have it stored in the bag. I don't know why it's in the bag, but I have it stored in the bag, but I got the purple. This is really my favorite color. Uh, I wish Cheek Sparrow had this color cause I would definitely jump on it. Uh, so I had the Foxy Fix, um, put this word on here the word is blessed that's my favorite word uh and i really like how this um this is i haven't used it yet but i really like the color it has the four strings inside it has a pocket and a pocket here and a pocket here and a pocket here so it doesn't have the credit card pockets but check this out what the heck wish cheek sparrow had that this is great to put cash in so yeah i really should switch to this um because it has the cash pocket and i bet you my cash would fit in there really nicely um but this is a size zero uh from foxy fix and yeah this is an awesome find um and I don't know what this is. Let's see what this is. This is just an empty bag. All right, so that's all I have in my Nano collection. Uh-oh, I found another Nano. Uh, yes, she was hiding. Anyway, this is a Huckleberry Nano. And this one, I have my art journal in here. Yes, it's very tiny. It's a tiny art journal. I've done a flip through of this. I used this, I think, for um, November or October daily journaling. And this is all my art journal. And this was a lot of fun to work in. Uh, and it's so tiny. And I need to add more. That's my wedding ring. It actually looks like my wedding ring. Look at that. Um, so, yeah. And this is a great flip through. Um, I have this notebook from Amazon in here. It is a pentallic uh, notebook and it fits nicely. It is a blank page. Uh, this is totally blank. You could do whatever you want on it. Uh, that was my last, last time I wrote in this was November 4th. So I liked, I got this date stamp and I was like dating each time I wrote in this thing. I need to continue working in this because I have a lot more pages to go. Uh, but uh, yeah, I really enjoyed working in this little book. So yeah, so that's that. The next size up is called a passport and I have three of them. I just videotaped this recently uh, because I did unbox two new ones. So I have three. I have a camel. Um, this is a, oh my God. This is a uh, caramel uh, color. I did try to sell this and it was on the buy sell trade list for a long time and no one seemed to want it. Uh, so I wound up keeping it. Anyway, this is Passport. Um, I have this one. I have the new one that I just, East, uh, Eastwood that just came in the mail. I just unboxed that in my last video and I have a Pembley Angel. So these, this one has a mark and I hate that things have marks, but this one has a, uh, mark there. Um, so I think I got this in second chance um sell so this one i got off the buy sell trade list and this one i got from cheek sparrow so i haven't used the passport uh, my goal for 2020 is to start using it it has great 
um, it fits great my pop-in books. So here are my pop-in books. I get these at Barnes and Noble, and I also you could get these at Staples. They are the perfect size. This is my everyday carry uh, that I use these little notebooks. Uh, these are the great, um, but I need to uh, start using carrying one of these. The next size is a pocket. Now the pocket is my everyday carry. I have it in a medium cheek sparrow pouch. This is Misty Mountain. This is the new color that they're coming out in 2019 and 2020. Um, yes, so oh, this is the medium size and I have my everyday carry in here. Uh, the one that I am using currently is a Pemberley purple, which is Eberdeen, I think the color is called, but it is retired. All Pemberley leather is retiring. Pemberley is my favorite leather, so um, you will see a lot of Pemberley coming up shortly because I needed to get the Pemberley. It does not scratch like Mr. Darcy. I love the little dots. It's wear and tear. I carry this every day. I have my little um my little um butterfly which reminds me of my niece who passed away emily uh she would have been 11 years old uh she passed away as an infant uh so yeah so this is my everyday carry and what i carry in here i have my lamy pen uh and what i have in here is um a dashboard of me and my husband um and i have the pop in notebooks um and this is my kids and my dog uh and the pop in notebooks this is my commonplace notebook uh this is anything i find on facebook pinterest anything that calls to me i write in here and i journal um and this is just writing usually uh, just quotes and stuff like that. So I put that in there. My Then I have my kids again. This is the dashboard, the other side of the dashboard. This is Christmas time and this is Halloween last, not this year, last year, 2018. Uh, and then this is my kids at Great Adventure. They work there. Uh, so yeah. Um, and then the second notebook is my life story and my life story I'm using journaling quotes from a book and every time I have the the question I put it in here so it's my life story uh, this is my life book number one and yeah so I started this in June 2019 and I just answer questions in here so like when I was little I played and different different questions and this is just writing okay so there's a picture of me back when i met my husband in 2000 um when did i meet him 1987 is when i met my husband 1987 and it actually says it there uh yeah i was very skinny i think i was a size zero that's me here um uh the next one <laughs> The next one is my autumn weather, um, sweater weather, and this is my autumn book. I actually have to change it to my winter book, but, um, and this has, um, fall quotes in here and I just decorated it and I put fall quotes and anything that speaks to me, uh, that goes in this book. And the third, this was my gratitude journal. I just started that in... October 25th so I've been writing five things that I'm grateful for and I've been writing that kind of every day whenever I remember uh, that's when I write in this book so I usually try to find five things that I'm grateful for and I write it in and I also date it with my date stamp uh, and then this one is my Thanksgiving book and this one has to come out because we're in December I just been carrying it around. This was my menu for 2019 because I host Thanksgiving. So that's the last book that's in here um, All right, so Going on what other ones do I have in the pocket size? I have one two three four five six seven eight 
pocket size uh, and I'm going to share with you each one however I may not know the names of the leather so we'll see if we can get through this so this one I won on the buy sell trade list on the Christmas uh, 12 days of Christmas I'm really excited because I did not have this one this is a Pemberley Rose I think it's called and I won this one so that's the first one then they had the Maverick sale and I have a Maverick the Maverick is very hard it's a hard leather it does not scratch uh, but it does not have any pockets um, it's very thick if you could see that um, and yeah I wanted this was on sale they had it on sale like I don't know what how much off but I wanted one in my collection so now I have it but um, as I said it's not floppy it's very hard and it does not scratch uh, the next one is a Pemberley. Um, this one I have stuffed. Even though it's stuffed with books, but I haven't even used it. Uh, it's stuffed with lots of books because I wanted to see how much it would stuff, I guess. Um, and this one is a Pemberley as well. I don't remember. I think it's called Honeysuckle. Um, but I'm not quite sure. But it's like an orangey color. And I really like the color. So that's that one. Then I have an Angel and angel is my favorite um i think i got this one or um at the second chance sale i think uh so that's the angel then i have an odyssey one um i don't remember the name of the color but this is a green odyssey this is also retired and very hard to find um and i have my little happy um bracelet from Michael's a clip to it and it's lots of inserts in there um, And then I have a black one which is a this is a um, Cream cream black beauty <laughs> so I have the black uh, And I have an insert in there some of them just hold inserts and then I have a this one which is a tea house leather I'm not sure but I did inscribe it uh, to more what makes you happy uh, and yeah it does mark the tea house marks see how there's like a mark there this one marks up a lot and it is starting to darken so and I just have this little clip on it it's just a keychain uh, but yeah it does mark up a lot and the last one that i have in this size is a cream the cream is very thick uh this is a thick i think this is cream brulee i got this off the buy sell trade list it's a thick leather um see how thick that is it's very thick i'm not sure i'm liking this one but um yeah i wanted the cream and it does mark up a little bit it's like it's the same line as the black beauty um yeah the black beauty is not it well yeah it is thick see so the black beauty is thick as well so these are my pockets moving on to one of my favorite sizes is the pocket plus and they have retired this size so once they said they they were no longer making it i had to collect some of these and i have seven of them so here we go i carry right now in my bag this one because it's the holiday one and and this one is this it is a um, Pemberley, um, I don't know the name of the color, it's the blue Pemberley, uh, and I had it engraved with Happy Christmaca because we celebrate a kind of both the holidays. Um, we have Hanukkah in our house and we go to my mother's for Christmas. So we kind of have both holidays uh, and so the the way I like this book is because it is thicker than my pocket. Um, I got some charms to put on here. Um, it has 
six uh, strings. So there is one, two, three um, of these things on the bottom. So that's how I know that it's a pocket plus because it has three where the other one only has two of these. Um, and yeah, I use this for my everyday carry for the Christmas time. And in here I have um, a Hanukkah book. I have a card book. I have pockets that I made and this is folders that I made out of envelopes, a gift one, and I have more pockets, a quotes for winter, and just whenever I find a winter quote I want to write down, I write it in here, and then I have recipes. And that's it in this book. So, yeah. So that's what I'm carrying. And I carry it around in a book sleeve that I made on my sewing machine. So that's how I'm carrying it. Okay. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six other ones. Uh, this one is a Mr. Darcy Titanic. Uh, and this holds my kids' um my kids um, money and their allowance. I keep track of how much they earned and how much I owe them and stuff like that. That's what's in here. Um, and then I have a Pemberley um, Brown. I don't, this is Oak, I think. Pemberley Oak. Uh, this I just got recently on the 50% off sale. Then I have a Mr. Darcy Buttered Rum. And I have a Mr. Darcy Purple Violet. And then I have a Pemberley. Um, this one is, this one I got the second chance sale because you can see how distorted the color is. This is um, an angel, but it's very distorted, uh, discolored, I mean. Um, yeah. And then I have. This is my favorite one. This is a Mr. Darcy Toffee. And as far as I know, they're supposed to be coming back with this color. So this is one of my favorites. This one I was carrying around um, a lot. And I have my book, my book charm on here. Um, yeah, I really love this one. I love the color and I would definitely be buying more of these. I got this off the buy, sell, trade list. Yeah, I love this color, so, yep. So those are my pocket pluses. The next size is A6, and I have th four of them. Okay, so the first one is a tea house leather, and this one I have a bracelet uh, wedged in here that says blessed with beads. Um, and I just have it wedged in the top and the bottom. Uh, this is my craft room um, Cheek Sparrow notebook where I keep track of all the ones that I bought, bought, sold, and purchased on the buy, sell, trade list and Cheek Sparrow. Plus I have cards in here and things I want to buy. It's just I have this notebook which is really cheap in here. It's a spiral. Here, wait. It's a spiral. Uh, five star mead book, and it fits nicely in the A5. So these you can get on sale when uh, in September they have them really cheap, um, two three dollars maybe, uh, and it fits nicely in the A5. And this is what I use to keep track of all my cheek sparrow wish lists and all that. So, yep. Um, so that's what I have in here. Uh, the next one is my Hobonichi five year uh, A5. And this one has, uh, I engraved. This is a tea house leather. Uh, this is our life, our story. And this has my five year uh, techo in here. Um, I can open it. This is five years. Uh, 2019 to 2023 uh, and I kind of write in here 
not every day, um, but I didn't get this until late in the year, uh, probably in the summertime. So um, I have to do a catch up for 2019, but I tried to write where we went, what we did, um, and stuff like that. So yeah, so that's this one. Uh, the next two are A5, what do I say, A6? A6 uh, E-Class ones. Uh, so I have two. I have a, a uh, Eastwood. This is the Eastwood one. And the E-Class is different because the pockets are different in it. It has a, this pocket and this pocket and a pocket here. Uh, and this has my 2020 Hobo uh, Weekly. And this is what I'm going to use for my financial book. And then I have another one, which is going to be for my reading. And um, yes, so I got that. These are bo both Hobonichis. And then my Hobo Techo 220 is in here. And this one is my, um, I do Project Life in here. And yeah, I put a photo and then I journal, which is really... Uh, nice it came out really nice, but it gets super thick So I wound up going with an AVAC for 2020 because the thickness let me grab it <laughs> The one for 2019 is super huge. Here is 2019 Look at that chunky monkey. This does not even fit in my book that I got with it Yes, it doesn't even fit. So this is the whole year uh, and what I do is I do a photo a day. So here you go. A photo a day plus washi tape and I journal about it. Uh, and I try to do it for almost every day. Uh, this is when I made Lifetime in Weight Watchers. Um, but I try to do it every day. There's just that piano recital and Justin found the football. Like, I try to write in here. Look, I have a lot of Justin. <laughs> I'm just flipping through. It's, that was just, on. Um, this is my parents. And, like, I just put a try to put a photo in here every day. This is uh, worked out really good. But, however, the book gets super fat and it does not fit in my book. So, I, that's why I went with uh, the AVAC for 2020. I really enjoyed it. And I was con I was keeping up with it. So, yeah. So, that's why I continued getting this so yeah and then I made a little bookmark and that's me and my husband and so I like to carry I had to put a pen loop or something on here so that's the dashboard that I made uh, and then the back has a pocket sorry the back has the pocket here and a pocket here um yeah so this is my 2020 book and this one is my huckleberry uh e-class as well and i don't know what in here this is a plain hobonichi uh i stuck it in here it's plain it doesn't it just has the gridded and it's plain but it's a hobonichi book uh so that's what i have in here and i got a pen loop this has the pen. I got the pen thing from Cheek Sparrow, which I glued onto a dashboard. So, yeah. It says, when you stop and look around, this life is pretty amazing. And that's what I put in there. And then I have some uh, Hobonichi thing here. And then this one I just found for Dotson's. I don't remember where I got this. Maybe Staples. This is a Stedler one. So that's what I have stored in there. Okay, the next one is the weekly calendar and I have four of them and three of them actually I am using. So this is my buttered rum, Mr. Darcy. This is my 2019 Hobo Hobonichi Weeks Mega is in here. And this one uh, is huge and very thick but i did not use all the pages so i wound up getting a regular weeks for 2020 so the next one is this one 
which is my Eastwood, and this is holding my 2020 Hobo. Uh, this is, I got a regular Weeks, so 2020. Uh, yeah, I really like this. I use this for my calendar on the go. This I carry in my in my pocketbook, uh, and usually I carry one. But right now I'm carrying both because I have December in here and December, January, the rest of the year in here. So I'm carrying both for, at this time. So that's that. And then I have my um, Pemberley uh, Blue. Uh, this is, um, this came with an inscription. This I got on the second chance sale and it came in inscription that I didn't like. So I glued on Snoopy. Uh, this is my weekly, um, this holds my menu planning and this is what I carry for my shopping list. And I have a um, Staples meal planning book in here. Um, this one I got for $1.99 at Staples. So it has my meal plan in here and like I carry this every Saturday uh, when I go to Weight Watches because that's when I do my food shopping. So that's that one. And the most recent one that I just got, I had to get this on the 50% off. This is the Pembley M Ember, Ember, Ember Jean, I think it's called. It's purple. So I had to have it. Uh, and they had it on clearance on the 50-50 sale. And I had to own it because I love purple and I love this leather. So, yeah. So now I have a purple one. So those are the four that I have. Moving on. I have four personal size, but one is a old one and three of them are the new size so this is the one i got on the buy sell trade list this is a personal size uh old version it's shorter than the others uh so this is a pemberley honey i believe and i had to own it and i wanted to see the difference so it's a cute size i really like it but it does not fit the weeks uh because it's shorter so here is the fern pemberley fern and this is a new personal size and you can see the difference in height there you go can you see the difference it's oh like a half an inch but uh, the Weeks, uh, Hobonichi Weeks fits better in the new size because it has the height. Um, yeah, so that's the only difference. Uh, but I do like the little personal size. It's nice. Uh, this is, I have the Fern. I have a Prince that I just recently got. Um, and these work great because my Hobonichi Weeks can come in and out of my weekly if I want to carry like inserts plus my Hobonichi weeks together it works great because the height is the perfect size for it so these are just filled with notebooks and these notebooks I have in here are from Staples for $1.99 these are awesome uh yeah look at that it's dotted grid 60 pages and at, they are $1.99 at Staples, can you believe? And they fit perfectly in this book. Uh, I have this purple, and I have a budded rum, um, Mr. Darcy. So again, I have it stuffed with the notebooks from, I think, I don't know. I have it stuffed with notebooks. So this one has a calendar in it uh, for 2019 and 2021. Yeah, this I got from um, Dollar Tree, I think. Um, yeah. So, but here's the notebooks again for $1.99. The notebooks fit great in here. Uh, and yeah, so this one's really stuffed to the max. It's not being used. It's just holding notebooks right now. Uh, this one too, it's just holding notebooks. Uh, and this one is also holding notebooks. So... I just have it on the shelf really nicely. These are my personal size. Next size is a B6 Slim. I have two of them. I'm not kind of finding, I'm not bonding with this size. So anyway, I have two of them. I have the Maverick, 
Um, and this is a classic Maverick. It has no um, no pockets because they don't make it to pockets anymore. Uh, but what I have in here are idea notebooks. Um, yeah. So that's that one. And then I had to get the purple. Um, this is the Pemberley Amberdeen, I think the color is called. It's purple. Uh, but it's the only size they had available and I had to have the purple. So in 2020, I plan to use this. So I hope that um, it will bond with me. But right now the B6 is something, B6 Slim is something I'm not really using right. But I do have, own, I own two of them. The next size is a B6 and I am currently using two of them and I have five. So this one is a Mr. Darcy Claire and I got this off the buy sell trade list and I love the quote. It says find joy in the journey. Uh, so I bought this all already made in the buy sell trade list. So this is my the second time I'm the second user uh, And what I have in here is my journaling prompts and I have a whole book in here with journaling prompts. I have a composition book um, That I got from either Staples or Walmart um, and I left the sticker on here so I knew what kind of book it was and I I separated it by months and I have quotes in here for each month so if I go to January so I took out from the library a whole bunch of journaling books and I started writing down quotes that questions prompts that I like to journal about so if I was going journaling and I came to January 1st uh, it says three resolutions or make up three resolutions for a character in a book and why. And then I just wrote one, two, three. So I would go all the way in every month, every day. I was writing these down. I think I got to June. I still have the book out from the library, so I'm still working on it. But I wrote down the quotes for every day of the year. And that's what I have in this notebook. The second notebook is a Stiology notebook, which I didn't even write in yet, but it fits nicely in here. Uh, and that's what I have in my journal book. This is journaling prompt book, I call it. Uh, so whenever I fa find a quote or whatever, actually I'm working on the artist way. Um, that's also in here as well. Let me find it. Um, See, here's the artist way and I'm, I'm up to week five and she gives you quotes and stuff to do and things to do. So I've been writing it in this book as well. So this is a current used book and I've used my highlighters and yeah, so I'm on week five of the artist way. Uh, so that's the first book. The second book is host, hold, uh, is holding my, um, this is a Cheek Sparrow. Um, um, what the hell? Um, sorry for my language. Uh, this is a cream black beauty and this has my YouTube channel in it and it also has my stickers in it. So what I have in here is a, um, photo, uh, book from Walmart, uh, that I have my stickers in here. And then the second notebook is a composition notebook from Walmart. And this one has my YouTube channel. And I just write down uh, what I'm videotape, what I uploaded, my ideas on the bottom. And I do it for we Every page has a week on it. So I know exactly what I did and where I left off. And yeah, so that's been helping out a lot. So that's that one. Then I have... A honey color. This is a Pemberley. As you can see, I like Pemberley. I have a lot of them. Uh, I think this is called honey. Um, and I have two E-classes. This is an Everwood, I think. Uh, I got this off the buy sell trade list. It does mark up a lot. You can see those marks on there. But the, I'm the second user, so... Yeah, so it has a lot of marks on there. So this is an E-class. 
and it has those pockets like the A5 does, the extra pockets. And this one was really cool. I found this at Walmart. And then this one is a cream. And this one I got, this is a cream brulee. And I got this in the second chance sale. And you can see the bug marks uh, on there. See the bug marks? bug bites or whatever you call it yeah this um yeah i don't really like this one so i don't know i might be selling this one i don't know um trying to bond with it as much as i can uh, but yeah it has a lot of marks and that i cringe every time i see it uh so anyway so those are my b6s the next one is wide and I'm really liking this size. I, uh, I own five of them and I am using three of them. So here we go. So the first one is this one, which is Mr. Darcy. Uh, this is Titanic, Mr. Darcy. I got this off the buy sell trade list uh, because it is retired. And this is my second favorite color. And what's in here is my daily december daily is in here my junk journal and you've seen a flip through of this it's getting really fat and junky look at that guy uh so i am on day 21 i am on day 21 here you go 21 so it is filled all the way to 21 and yeah it's fat and chunky but I'm loving the size and I will be continuing on. I may even do this in January as well because I'm really liking and enjoying this. So that's the first one. The second one is my calendar. And I got this one off the buy sell trade list. This is an angel, uh, Pemberley Angel, and it has the quote hashtag blessed on it. I got this off the buy sell trade list. And this one holds my calendar on my desk. Now, I jot down everything in here. It's a Moleskine. I have 2019 and 2020 in there right now. So this is the Moleskine. And this is 2020. This one's 2019. I have it on my desk. I leave it open to this page or whatever and i leave it open on my desk so i jot down my appointments and stuff in here i love this size i transfer everything it's laid out just like the whole bonichi weeks but bigger and i love uh to put my appointments on it so i transfer everything from here to my weekly uh hobonichi weeks so i could carry it around with me uh yeah it's i'm doing double work but i'm really enjoying it. i do not decorate this at all this is just information for me to tell me where i have to be at what time i also jot down if i um if i use money or whatever i jot down phone numbers anything doctor appointments anything i need to jot down goes in this book so that's what i keep on my desk um and this one is a Mr. Darcy. I don't know the name of the color, sorry. I got this from the Second Chance Sale. Uh, and this one is holding my uh, reading journal. So, um, yeah, I have a reading journal in here. I have a fat one that's sticking out. You can see it's sticking out. It doesn't really fit in here. Uh, but it's so many books, so little time. I made this for 2019, so I stuck it in here to continue because I didn't finish all the pages. So I jot down my reading, my goals, and everything else. I have already in here a 2020 reading challenge list in here. Uh, so that's the first one. And then I have this one is a, I think it's a Moleskine notebook uh, that I jot down books that i want to read winter book thrillers um it's just lists a list and lists of books that i want to read uh it's constantly writing anything book related goes in this book so yeah i have a lot of book stuff in there uh and the last two i just got i just i didn't do an unhaul but i just got them this week i got a 
Prince, which is purple. And I got a buttered rum. So these are totally new. I didn't do an unboxing. Uh, these both are classics. The other ones are deluxes. And what I mean by classic, it has no pockets. So I went, I got, used my 50% off coupon. I love this size. I said, let me try it without the pockets, without the pen loop. Uh, and I got two of them. So it holds the cashier uh, Moleskine notebook. So I have three of them in here. Um, don't know what I'm going to use it for yet, uh, but I have the notebooks in there. I have that in there, and I have the same thing in here as well. And, oh, I made a little thing that I made with to hold the pen. So, yeah, I have three of those notebooks in here. Cashier. This is really flimsy, though. I'm like very flimsy it bends very easily uh the other one is very solid yeah that's the big difference in the classic so that's the difference okay i have one narrow this is a pemberley um, I don't remember the name of the color sorry it's a turquoise color it's retired um, I don't, I ordered this by mistake. This was my second purchase from Cheek Sparrow and I just did not bond with the size. However, I do have something in here that fits very nicely. So I need to start working in this again. And I have a nice butterfly for Emily in the front. And what I have in here is my magazine journal. So here is my magazine journal that I made in 2017. I have not worked in it since 2017. I did quite a few pages. I was using it as a bullet journal. Uh, so look, it's like a bullet journal, just collections of notebooks and things like that. Uh, yeah, so it's more like a bullet journal, but that's what I was using this for 2017. So I do have more pages that I could still work in it this much more uh, that I can try to finish up maybe in 2020 I will pick this up again and add more more stuff to it so that's what I have here um, and I have a really nice necklace that my kids I think it's a bookmark that my kids gave me um, beaded bookmark that says mom on it that I have and it comes out the bottom with beads so that's the narrow size the last size that i have is the a5 and i have two of them this was my very first purchase from cheek sparrow this is a mr darcy violet and i have my bullet journal in here and i haven't written in here in a while um but it's a bullet journal this is the book that i got from michael's for like five bucks and it's just a bullet journal and i've been i used it for um 2000 i started in 2017 so i did inktober and i was drawing in here and writing things and stuff like that so yeah so i don't really write in here that much i do have a lot more pages to this is where i ended so i have a lot more pages that i could still use uh, but this is sits on my desk open like this because this is my Netflix tracker and what I'm watching on TV and I just jot in what um, as I watch something I cross it off so that's what sits on my desk and then my Hobonichi uh, my Fobonichi is in here this is an angel um, no I'm sorry this is a daisy this is a Daisy, Pemberley Daisy, and this has my Hobonichi, Fobonichi in it. And uh, fat, it's fatting really fat. So look at that. Um, I've been using my Fobonichi for six years now, and it's uh, a notebook that I got. This. I got this from Barnes and Noble and I really love this one. This is my sixth book because I did it for six years and every month I do the washi tape on the end. I do flips. I did flips on my YouTube channel uh, but I haven't done a flip in a while. 
but this is what I do every single day. I put photos in here. I write about my day. Um, yeah, I am writing this every day. Uh, this sits on my desk and I jot down what we did, what we, I, sometimes I draw. It depends on my mood. Here's my picture from school. I just, um, I tipped it in. Um, and yeah, so that's this journal. So yeah, I've been writing in this and here's the card that I just got from, um, from Christine. Uh, I told you I put it in my, my, uh, my Fobonichi and it's in here. Um, I, t I glued, um, I used tape and I tipped it in here and then she sent me some of these things and look what I did to the back. I put the thing that she sent. I covered up her address. Um, yeah, so yeah. So that's it. Um, I do have one more. I'm sorry. One more, which I just unboxed, which is my Prince folio uh this is an a5 so that's it for my a5s that's it for my cheek sparrows thank you for watching my voice is my throat's really dry um and it's a long video thank you for watching and i hope to see you in another video bye